Well, happy holidays from Don Gettling and Gino Fronte with the National Real Estate Cafe, and we're very joyous about the jobs report. It is. Actually, <laughs> you know, it's funny. We call that Don's drum. He always talks about jobs, but you haven't heard him beating the drum lately. Why? This is why. We'll start with this first slide. Oh, how about this? 92 straight weeks of unemployment claims below 300,000, the longest stretch since 1970. How's that for stability of our economy? Well, if we remember, Gino, when we first started, uh, shoot, on our Don and Gino Real Estate and Finance show, you know, every week, you can check it out at donandgino.com, the numbers were well above 400,000 unemployment claims, and now we're below 300,000 for 92 straight and weeks. we struggled to break 300. I mean, it was oh. a fight to try to get under 300. Then when we got there, it was like 392, 295, 304, 302. Yeah. It was very, very hard. And now we've been substantially below that for quite some time. Well, let's show you the next chart. Here you go. Oh, there you go. It's averaging right around that 250 to 260 stage. La uh, December's numbers are really good. So as you can see, the initial jobless claims are well below 300 for quite some time now. Nice and stable, and we don't see any changes coming soon. In fact, job market's starting to get a little tight. So you might actually see this number go down a little further. I agree. All right, so next chart here. Oh, the jobs report. As you can see, we wanted to show you this chart mostly because you're going to see some really good numbers. Now, they've been consistent, you can see, but you also see some cyclical numbers, meaning November, December, pretty strong because there's a lot of part-time. Remember, these are part, a lot of part-time jobs being added on for the holidays. I know, but look at this, Don. This is so interesting. Look at November over November. How different is that? Almost a $100,000 difference. The thousand hundred thousand dollars, a uh, hundred thousand job difference. There you go. <laughs> Say that ten times fast. But pretty strong number all the same. So the job market has been strong. And our last report, the ADD, ADP report. <laughs> I know one of my least favorite reports, but it's and still something everybody looks at. Very inconsistent though. Super inconsistent. So not one of our favorite reports, but overall looks like a positive trend. Okay. So there you have it. We like to give you the trends so you understand what's going on. One report does not make a trend, and you can see that the jobs have been very consistent, and we're starting to see some uh, income growth, actually. Yeah, so I'm going to use a little bit of a punny thing, but the trend is your friend when it comes to jobs. So take advantage of it. Buy a home right now. Interest rates have started to tick up, but it's not too expensive to buy a home. So check us <laughs> out, nrecafe.com. And see us tomorrow. We'll back up what Gino just said about interest rates not really affecting the housing market. You'll see us tomorrow on the National Real Estate Cafe.